Hello and welcome to day 13. Uh, today's prompt was Zelda. It did a little bit. She's still technically Zelda, but I decided to do Tetra. But I'm gonna put like little nods to her being Zelda in the picture. I did Tetra back in 2017, um, and like, I liked it, but I wasn't that necessarily happy with it, so I'm trying to do better this time. Uh, I tried to do sort of a mash between the Wind Waker style and my style. I hope it turns out okay. So, onwards. So, I had a lot of trouble getting what I wanted down on the paper. I eventually just got frustrated enough that I just turned the camera off <laughs> and just sort of, I, I, I have some issue sketching sometimes when the camera's on just because of where I have to have the sketchbook. I like to sketch very close to me. So if I'm having issues sketching, I pull it close, but if I pull it close, then the camera can't see it. So I just turn the camera off. Um, and then eventually got, uh, what I wanted. Um, and then it wasn't until after I went into the line work that I realized the head and neck were kind of placed wrong on the body, but the inking was already done and I couldn't really fix it. Um, but other than that, I'm very happy with how the proportions and such turned out after I finally got it to a place where I wanted. Um, and I think I did a fairly good job of mixing the Wind Waker style with my own style. Um, yeah, I had, I had fun with it once I got past the irritation of the sketching phase. And I'm really happy with the result. And I hope you enjoy the final result as well once you get to the end. Um, I'll be quiet now.
All right, and here we are coming to the end. I am very happy with the result. I think she looks sassy yeah. and Tetra. Um, I think she's my favorite out of all the Zeldas just because I mean, she's pirate princess. I mean, come on. Uh, and I hope you enjoy the result and will continue to join me for the rest of the month. So, till the next one, guess tomorrow. See you later. Bye.